New Japan Pro Wrestling's Road to Dominion 2021 tour continues today, and we had another show that took place, of course, in Cork and Hall. We had a highlight match or two take place. We had a main event that was contested for the Never Open Weight Six Man Tag Team Championships, of course, between Los and Gobernables de Japones, Bushi, Naito, and Sonata taking on Yoshihashi, Tomohiro Ishii, and Hiroki Goto. We know that's the main event. Let's talk about the matches that we got preliminary wise, preliminary style. We have Evil, Chase Owens, Taiji Ishimori, and El Phantasma, of course, with Dick Togo taking on Hiroshi Tanahashi, Tamaki Homai, Yoda Suji, and Yura Yamura right here. So, honestly, this was a fun opener. We had lots of action. Everybody worked hard in this match. Evil and Yamura started us off right here. We got EOP tagged in. He got some breakdancing and some comedy offense here. We got Tanahashi and Owens going back and forth. For, Owens actually ate a forearm from Tanahashi. Uh, Yamura actually ended up tagging his way back in. He started getting fiery. He had a running forearm and he had a back suplex for two. He ultimately fell by Taiji Ishimori's bloody cross for I think it was around 11 minutes and 47 seconds. We got the Bullet Club team getting a victory right here. Solid opener. Nice way to start the show off. Not too bad. So the next match, we have Yo, Sho, and Rizuke Taguchi taking on and defeating the team of El Desperado, Yoshinobu Kanemaru, and Doki in about 10 minutes and 48 seconds. So it looks like Yo blocked Doki, Suplex De La Luna, then used the Stargazer Calf Killer for the submission to get the victory right here. This was another good match. I expect Yo and Desperado to have a great match on Monday. Desperado, as we all know, has really upped this game since the end of 2020 and has been really good this year this far. So he's the IWGP reigning junior heavyweight champion. Yeah, man, El Desperados is firing on all cylinders right now. So, match number three we have on the show. Taichi, Zack Sabre Jr., and Minoru Suzuki comprising the team of Suzuki Gun, taking on the Bullet Club trio of Tamatonga, Tangaloa, and Ghetto. And if you're wondering why Ghetto is in this match, Jado actually was revealed to have an injury. Uh, it was on New Japan 1972. I didn't read the extent of the injury, so speedy recovery for Jado. Hopefully he gets well. Have him back soon. So, Ultimately, as this match go, they really couldn't top their effort from last night, and they really ultimately didn't even try. Uh, we get Bullet Club jumping Suzuki in the ring before Taiji Song had even finished playing. They fought around the ring ringside briefly. Uh, Savory actually was briefly uh, cut off in the ring. He, just, he was actually being a one in peril right here. <clears throat> we get Tonga Loa and Tama Tonga going for a match of killer on Zack Sabre Jr. Minoru Suzuki and Taiichi make the save. Sabre used a neck crank and a Clarky Cat to get the victory on Ghetto right here. Yeah, this was fun. It was about 2 minutes and 24 seconds. Very quick. They didn't do much here, so which ties us into the intermission and ties us into the looks like the penultimate match of the show we have representing the United Empire, Jeff Cobb and Great Okan taking on and defeating Kota Ibushi and Master Wado right here. This was pretty solid. This Khan used the Eliminator to get the victory on Wado for the pin. Um, Ibushi and Cobb had a wild brawl after the match. Suji, Yamura, Suji and Yamura jumped in to try to pull them apart. Just when you thought it was over, one of them would break free and the brawl would start all over again. They fought in the ring and they fought all around the ring, arena, in my opinion. This was really more about the ankle than it was the match. The, po the ma match was fine, but the post-match stuff was fucking awesome. I loved it. I fucking loved it. So now, guys, we're at the main event. We are at for the Never Open Weight Six Man Tag Team Championship. Roki Goto, Tomohiro Ishii, and Yoshihashi taking on. Fuck! And goddamn it, defeating Los and Gobernadores de Japones, Bushi, Tetsuya Naito, and Sonata right here. Man, this was an excellent six man match. The first 10 minutes were kind of slow, but they had to go quite a long time, so it was kind of be expected right here. But this was a solid fucking match, man. They did so much stuff in this match, I can't really cut. We got Bushi missing an MX. He actually hit an MX for a near two count. Bushi had a couple near falls in this match to where you thought LIJ was picking up the victory for his team right here. So this was a fucking solid match. Uh, Naito and Ishii stirred each other down after the match. The best part of all this is it looks like we're getting a Naito Ishii singles match probably at Dominion if they're able, you know, ever uh, get around to announcing the rest of the card because we know there are three matches on there. Yoshihashi cut a quick, pro quick promo on the champ pose with their titles to close the show. So, yeah, this was actually uh, two, if you combine the two uh, Quark and Hall shows, really solid row two shows for New Japan Pro Wrestling. Of course, the highlight of these shows are both the title matches, that being the IWGP Heavyweight Tag Team title match and the six-man tag team title match. But if you want highlight match from this show, 
I would say the United Empire versus Wado and Ibushi. And of course, the main event, that being Chaos versus LIJ. So we are at all the almighty SOS Wrestling Network. Be sure you like, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. The price of subscription, my guys, my gals, is free 99 It don't cost you a fucking penny. So I'm up out here, man. So yeah, it looks like our next big show as far as New Japan goes is Dominion taking place this Monday. I, it's fifth day, ever announced the rest of the card. I'll preview the card for you guys. So... Holla at y'all later. You know what it is. A pro wrestling fly guy. Stardust Yaku, man. Signing out. SOS Wrestling Network. The almighty. Toodle fucking Pippington.